on the first day when we look at all the paintings that have been submitted, um, we all, all the judges sit round in a semicircle. And if one person says yes, then no one argues with that because that, that's someone who feels passionate about that particular painting or they think they do on the first day. They may not on the second day when they see it again. On the second day, we look at the 300 shortlisted paintings and reduce it to the 55 that we had in the final exhibition. And from that 55, we select the prize winners. This year, it was 2,187 entries from 74 different countries across the world. Every painting that we see is a portrait of one kind or another. It may be quite an abstracted portrait or a photorealist portrait, but they're all portraits of one kind or another. Content, originality, technique, um, a level of expertise, all those things come into play. But I think what's really important is the painting, the portrait has to speak to you. You have to sort of feel that you're coming face to face with a person. And that's a really important criterion for the exhibition. All the paintings are judged anonymously. We're not given the name of the artist, although the director and I will recognise certain artists who enter the competition because obviously they, we've come across them in our, in our work. Um, but we won't, we won't declare their names to the other, to the other um, judges. Um, so we are judging anonymously, but we, c we do sometimes ask what the title of a work is because that can, can influence um, your decision and the way you look at the painting.